Here's the new time machine device I created for Synchro. The most prominent feature is the knob in the center here. When you move this, rotate this clockwise and counterclockwise, you're moving forward and backwards through time. You'll notice across the top we have all the play ribbon buttons, such as skip to the end, beginning, skip to the end, steps backwards, steps forward, reverse play, stop, play forwards. You can also click on the knob itself to toggle between play and stop. These buttons on the side here adjust the speed of the playback. They adjust the increments of time. So now jumping to two days or a week or a month and you can make your model go quicker or slower. When you're in animation mode, these adjust the animation speed as well. There's the loop button to toggle between loop modes. The viewpoints button allows you to jump through all the viewpoints that you have saved in Synchro. The animations button allows you to jump through all the animations that you have in Synchro. And it gives you full control over that playback. At the bottom of the screen, we have four layout buttons. These were what's known as memo view, now they're being called layout, where you can jump to preset uh, window layouts within Synchro.